Great! I knew you were all right. Are you ready to shove off for Oil Spill Island? Finally, someone who takes me seriously. No cracks about the one that got away or a really big fish story. She. Okay, let's go. Uh, yeah, by the way, you might want to hold on to something. You know, this used to be a beautiful place before the trolls came and started drilling for oil. They give it all to Chaos for his crazy machines. And then if things weren't bad enough, they captured my people. But now you're here. Go take care of business, Skylander. Free them and teach those trolls a lesson. And hurry, I can already smell the cooking fires and tartar sauce. <laughs> Save our people before they become fish sticks! Hey guys, Psychic Pictures here, and welcome back to Skylander Spyro's Adventure. Originally, oil was a popular Molkin hair tonic. Unfortunately, it made all their hair fall out. Now that the Molkin are all bald, oil is pretty much just used as a fuel source for tech machines. In this episode, we will be helping out the Gilmans, and I'm actually playing as a character that you can get from an adventure pack. Troll Grease Monkey. And I'm playing as Ghost Roaster. Also another one of my favorites, because he has high damage. He actually does pretty high damage. This is also a puzzle that we are going to be seeing a lot of later in the game. Redirect the energy beam to open the gate. Thank you, Leon. I didn't figure that out. I wouldn't be able to figure that out. Pick the cut. Tech spell pump. playing as Gilgrim right now. This is why. Skylanders that can actually go on water are the, well, water Skylanders. Let's do this! And here is a Skylander that is also replacing Hex. Zoop. This guy actually is not that bad. This is also a character I got for five bucks. Ah! <laughs> 
he actually has a shroom shield that surpasses a certain other shroom shield with person. Lesser troll. Die. Zook will take care Our of you. Of the tech element are stronger in this zone. All right. So yeah, we have to redirect this to go to there. Yada yada. Uh, we also need to get skeleton keys or certain things that you'll see later. Please. You'll need the skeleton keys to free the Gilmans. You have to free all five of them before you can actually go and uh, finish off the level. Tech spell pump, die! Uh, there is something on the water over here, but I'm going to go and take care of these guys first because they're annoying me right now. They hurt me. They physically hurt me. Die! Die. And also, you get shiny treasure. Hey, none of it fell in the water this time. Nice! Let's see. And yes, the other soul gem is, in fact, on the water. We will not be previewing Boomer, because that's for the end slate. And I believe that's all for the Water Skylander. Let's go back to Ghost Roaster. Because he didn't have that much time in the spotlight. There's also one other Sky Skylander I'm going to be uh, showing you guys. But, uh... For the most part, that's all I'm going to show for this episode. Die everything. There we go. Redirected that and did that. Yay. We rescue that Gilman. <laughs> Die! Skeleton key. And I hate this maze. You need a fire skyline to unlock this. And here's our fire skylander. Eruptor. <sighs> and honestly, I hate this stupid maze. Because you go out one end, you go out another end, and it's terrible. That one's opened up. So, now we take one of two paths to who knows where. And one of two paths to who knows where. I'm not going to go through every path, but I will say this. Um, there's a hat when you go through one of these paths. 
I can't exactly remember which one it is. And I'm not gonna bother to look because it could take forever. And I don't want to go and bore you guys with that one thing that one thing that I would be doing in, for the entire episode. Oh gosh. There's that. Let's go to the middle one. This entire thing is a maze. I hate it. See, there's the hat over there. And over here, we have our legendary treasure. <laughs> Worth 200 gold. I'm not gonna bother to get the hat though, because it would take Skyline way too long. Are stronger in this zone. But there is a path that you can take to go and get the hat. I just don't know right now, and I don't want e to even try. Because <laughs> it didn't look like it, but I was trying to go and find the stupid hat. But I just could not find the right one. I could not find the right place that I needed to be. <clears throat> Blech. Lava barf. Oh gosh. There we go. There's that. Boom! There's another Gilman freed. Just need one more Gilman. And we can complete this mission! Mark 31 Troll Tank. It has a weakness on its back. Yeah, level up. When you level up, you explode everything around you. And I believe it deals 100 damage. I know it does a fixed amount of damage, but I believe it's 100 only. And some... Uh, some uh, Some enemies have more than 100 damage, so they won't be destroyed by the... Uh, by the you did it. level up. You know, I wouldn't have believed it if I hadn't seen it with my own eyes. I hate to say it, though, but we still need your help. It's this factory. It's polluting our waters and generally mucking things up. It's ruining everything. Please, help us destroy it. I know you didn't mean mucking. Say, you know, if you could get your fins on a troll bomb... <laughs> Maybe throw it into that big smoke belcher. I think that would do it. Kaboom! The trolls would be gone, our home would be safe, and then maybe I'd run out of things to complain about. Although probably not. Alright. So all we need to do now is throw a bomb. Which does 350 damage to everything in its path. Or 100. Never mind. Oh, and also... Money! Yay! Does this go and... destroy this? Nope. You have to do, go and do that to a specific one, apparently. Oh well. Yeah! Destroy! 
We have won. That was great! Especially for a landlubber. You saved us all. Thank you. I keep trying to look through the far viewer, but it's a little rusty and it won't turn past a certain point. Do you mind, fish fingers? I'm trying to concentrate. There, it's finished. Ta-da! <laughs> On behalf of my people, I present you with this oil donkey. I did name it. And it comes with all the oil you could ever want. Very impressive, Mr. Gurglefin. And that's exactly what we need right now. Perfect. We should be able to use that on the far viewer. Grab a can of that stuff and meet me up there. Yay! Oil! We now have oil to go and oil stuff. Uh, the oil is going faster than we are. What the heck? Hey, cheap. Burn! <laughs> yeah! There, I think that should do it. <gasps> there it is. The twins. Let, let me back up a step. We'll need the eternal water source to add to the core of light, but. According to my blueprint, the water is no good to us unless we can get something called the Twin Spouts of Osha Major Minor, which I found! There! Holy anchovy! That's Darkwater Cove! Oh, it's a nasty place, filled with pirates. I'll bet the Twin Spouts will fetch a pretty penny for a plundering pirate. Sorry for the alliteration there. Let me prepare the ship then. I'll just go. I'll go now. As much as I hate to say it, you should go with Gurglefin. I'll keep looking for clues to the eternal water source. You can leave whenever you're ready. All right. So, that just about wraps it up for this episode. This has been Psychic Pictures, and I'll see you guys next time.